Angels live in my town. Okay, so we've got this lotto story. Uh, I'm just going to read here from uh, yeah. So this CTV lady, news. This lady won the lottery. She won a million dollars. She lives from she lives in Thorold. Yeah, it says Ontario retiree has won the lottery after playing with her numbers that she came to her in a dream. So basically, she played these lotto numbers that she had in a dream. Um, she. I don't know, played them for a while. It doesn't say the amount, the long, how long she played these numbers. Right. But she had them in a dream. She won. But it wasn't like she had the dream, played the numbers, and won. And won. No, no. It sounds like, it says here, the 64-year-old said she had been playing the same numbers ever since they came to her in a dream. It doesn't say how long. Yeah. But uh, it says she played them. Um, she's a local from the Niagara region, Thorold, Ontario. Does it say what she does for a living? Uh, re- retiree. Retiree? Retiree. Retiree. How do you say that? Retiree. 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 That's it. Thank you. That. She's a retiree. So this that means she's she's got to be in her 60s, right? You would think, unless she's had good luck and able to retire earlier. She looks pretty good for her age. Well, the mask hides quite a bit. But That's I mean, true. I don't know. She looks like she's a pretty lady. Piercing blue eyes. Yeah. She looks she, uh, she looks like the type of lady that would say something like this, though. <laughs> so you're, wait, let me get this straight. So you're saying people that win the lottery, they come up with like stories? Is that what we're going to do? Well, I'm, I'm saying like if I won the lottery, that's exactly what I would do. I would oh, tell people, okay. I'm like, yeah, um, <laughs> Jesus came to me in a dream and uh, and he gave me the numbers to win the lottery. Just to fuck with people. Just to fuck with their so heads. So then you think people get crazier and start thinking of more schemes to buy more lottery tickets? Actually, or, or, you should do that. They, maybe the lottery pushes people to it'll just drive them that. nuts. It'll be like, oh my God. Uh, or, or, you know, he's got some magic that I don't have. Oh, my God, know? this craft dinner box, that zero is smudged. Right. I think this is the number. Right. You could, yeah, you could come up with <laughs> any... barcodes. They're starting to play. People are starting right. to play barcodes. The bus driver told me these numbers. I was on a bus, and he just gave me these numbers, and I played them, and they won. <laughs> you know? It could be any crazy story you want. But I'm thinking, like, this woman, she, I mean, that might be true, but... I don't know. Like, how many times do you remember a series of seven numbers in a dream? How many? How often do you remember dreams? Right. I mean, like, like, and that's very specific. Seven specific numbers. I mean, I don't know. I think this is a made-up dream because I think she wants people to believe that she's clairvoyant. Because she oh. looks like that. She looks like a woo-woo kind of that you know that new age spirituality like hippie chick. Like a gypsy. Kinda. Do not fear me, gypsy. All I want from you is your tears. Please give them to me or I will take them. I'm not a gypsy. Yeah. Like a new age spirituality, like, mm-hmm. you know, to sh- you know, with the chakras and the, uh, you know, <laughs> and the gemstones. <laughs> like she's probably, she's probably got, she's probably got those, you know, those, those healing stones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The crystals. I she's mean, probably all into that shit. And then she's like, yeah, I dreamt the numbers. I'm a, I'm a clairvoyant. I got special abilities. You will send me your stuff, gypsy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I read this comic book and then the com just these numbers just popped out on me Jesus. and I played them and I'm a millionaire now. That's hilarious. Oh. Anyways, well, this, I mean, she's from Thorold. She bought the ticket at Park Goldburn. She won a million bucks. Congratulations. Playing. That's awesome. I'm rich, bitch. I mean, that's awesome. That's a million bucks in this uh, area. It helps. Uh, that it almost helps. buys you a house. <laughs> Nowadays, yeah. It helps, though. It helps. It definitely helps. I mean, I could. I drive. mean, if you're 60, I'm hoping at that point, I'm assuming you're a retiree. Retiree? That's, that's a million cash, tax free, homie. Like, you could yeah, take like, that. Yeah, like, I mean, that's. At her point, she should be comfortable already at her age. Right. And I mean, if you're a retiree, you got, no, you got nothing tying you down, go to a country where a million dollars, you could live the rest of your life like a king. I think later on this article, that's she said she was going to use it to travel with her grandkids, which is nice. That sounds nice. Yeah. Good yeah. for you. Congratulations, uh, Deborah Rose. Deborah R. Yeah. of Thorold. Deborah Rose. Congratulations. Congratulations.